Hey guys, what's up? It's Yami here and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Eden. So in today's episode, I'm going to build my first animal room. I'm probably thinking that it's going to be a wolf room. I think that would be good. Or a dog room. I really don't know what I should call them. Probably just uh, dogs. <laughs> I'm going to call them dogs and cats. So I just need to chop down some oak wood. For some reason, this tree is floating. I really don't know why that is. So strange. Woo! Oh my gosh, so many saplings. This is going to be great though, because I will be able to replant these near the animal shelter. Okay, so let's go back to the animal shelter. I really need to waypoint it because I haven't yet. Oh my god! Well, I died. Okay, so I'm going to go to sleep. Okay then, so let's turn these oak wood logs into planks. Also, saplings. Let's go plant some of these around the animal shelter. Um, we can just plant some random ones on the outside of this place. So the first job is finding where I'm going to put this next room. Let's go get a spade or a shovel, whatever you want to call it. And we can mark it out. Okay, so I reckon that this is going to be a corridor. I've got a great idea. Let's have a corridor that goes down this way as well. And this can go down quite long because the room that we're going to need to keep animals in is going to be quite big. Okay, so there we go. I just need to go and make two doors now. And I think I have some picket fence that I can use. Although I'm not really sure. If not, I'll try and use something else. Let's have a look. Yeah, I have some picket fence. I would use iron bars, but as soon as I have the fence, why not just use that? Also fence gates and glass. And I will take some glowstone as well. So I'm just going to go and make two doors. I think the crafting table is in the staff room, so... Oh my gosh. There is a baby white tiger out there. Here is two doors. So this baby tiger thing is really annoying me. What are you doing? No! Gosh darn it. Okay, so is there any torches? I really need to torch this place up. Oh dear. There is no torches. Instead, let's use our trusty glowstone and we can start setting out some pens for the dogs. I should have probably made the pens a little bit bigger. I feel like this is gonna be too small for them. Okay guys, so I fixed it and this is what it looks like. It's actually far deep, which is a lot bigger than it was before, so there's a lot more room for the dogs. And I'm thinking about having it fenced off like this so kind of like that for each dog and then i think a door rather than a fence gate i'm not sure would a fence gate work okay so a fence gate would work but i'm thinking that a door would probably look best oh dear okay i think that fence gates may have to be the better option because the door doesn't work at all so yeah, let's use the fence gates instead, like that. I don't think a dog would be able to get out of that. Okay guys, so this is what the pens look like. I just need to double up the fences here, and also I need to finish the walls and the roof. But when that's done, it should just look like a animal shelter area. I really didn't know how to make the dog place. I just, I've never, I've never actually been to an animal shelter before. So I'm just assuming that this is what they look like. Well, maybe they don't look anything like this, but at least I tried. <laughs> okay, so like I said, I just need to finish the roof and then I can get started on what's going inside of this place. And I can also get started on looking for some wolves to rehome. Okay, so now that I've finished cobbling up this place, I really need to put some windows in here because it is pretty dark. Good job that I have some glass here. Let's just put a window in each of the dog pens. There's also a little hamster in here. What are you doing here? You're so cute. You're so cute. Okay, so I finished that now. Let's go make a table for here and also a lamp because it is pretty dark in here and I'm not sure why because we do have quite a lot of windows so it just doesn't make any sense at all okay so we have some wool although it looks like i'm going to need to go out and get some more because you need wool for a lamp so let's get our shears on our way to the barn let's go and return all of our cooking pots back to our kitchen 
So here we are in our kitchen. Let's put all the pots back. I think this is the wrong cupboard, but as long as we're in the kitchen, that's fine. Let's equip our shears and let's go get some more wool. Okay, so let's just get some wool. We may as well just shear them all. Seems like we're going to need a lot of lamps for the animal shelter anyway, so the more wool, the merrier. Okay, so let's go in here and we can make ourselves a lamp. I'm pretty sure you need sticks and you need a light bulb which is glass panes and a torch if i remember correctly okay so to make a lamp i'm pretty sure it's like this i could be wrong though i haven't made one in a while there we go table lamp and to make a table it's just slabs and wood like this yes okay another thing that i wanted to make was a dog toy uh, it's a teddy bear, I think. Teddy bear. Here we are. A stuffed wolf. Bones and raw beef. We could easily make that. That's so cool. And we could also make a wolf head just to put outside so we know what animals are kept inside of the room. So first things first, let's go sleep because it is actually night time. And now that it's morning, let's go and make some stuff. So I need to find myself my bones. I don't have many of them. I reckon that I've got some in the chest downstairs in my house. We also need to go and kill a cow. So let's go find a cow. I am so sorry. Please don't hate me. Oh no. So we have some raw beef. Um, let's go get the bones from my basement. And I'm also pretty sure it said that I needed redstone. So I'm just going to take a big bunch of that. Here we are. We have some bones. Let's go back to our animal shelter and we can get making the stuff that we need. Okay, so first of all, I'm going to make the stuffed toy dog. And to make that, I think we just need bones and a piece of beef in the middle. So there we have it, a stuffed wolf. Okay, so let's put the table down here. Let's put the lamp on it and let's also put the stuffed wolf on it. Yay! Isn't that just adorable? Oh my gosh, I am in love! Okay, so I was also thinking that we could make some food bowls for the animals. I know that the dogs aren't the doggy talent dogs that I'm going to tame. They're going to just be wild wolves, but we could still make it. I think it'll look pretty cool. So that's iron ingots and a bone. So here we are. Put those in the middle. One, two, three, four, five, six. Woohoo! So I should have six doggy food bowls now. Let's go put these in the shelter in the corner for one each. I also think we should go and make some carpet if I don't already have some. I don't think we do. Nope, we don't. And I'm going to use lapis to dye the carpet as well. I wanted to make a bed for each of the dogs, just like a little bit of carpet in each of the rooms here. And to do that, I'm going to need two pieces of blue carpet for each animal area. Okay, so let's put the lapis and the wool together. A barber pole wall. That is so cool. Okay, so we should definitely have enough now, hopefully. Let's have a little look, see if we do. Okay, so there we have it. We have our doggy beds and also our doggy food bowls. I don't know what else a dog could possibly need in there. I reckon we have enough. Okay, so it doesn't look like there's anything else to put in here except for the wolf's head, which I can go and make now. So the redstone and the wool. And now we should have the wolf's head. And we've also run out of wool now. Let's just go put this outside of the door. So probably on here. And then we will know that this is where the wolves live. I know that wolves live in winter biomes, but that's as far as my knowledge extends. Hopefully there's going to be some around here. I have seen some near the animal shelter before, but I didn't tame them. And now I kind of regret it. Here one is. Hello. Okay, so we've got one here. Okay, so I find another one. Let's tame that. And now we have two. Let's go take these guys back because I don't think there is any more wolves. And in the future, if we do see any wolves, we can just go and tame them as well. But for now, we should be okay with just two. Okay, are they going to come in here or what? Okay, there's one here, so... Are you going to sit down? There we go. We have one in there. And let's try and get the other wolf into a room down here. 
There we go. We have another one. So let's lock this place up and go to sleep and in the morning we shall give them names. Okay, so the first name I'm going to choose is Buddy. And the second name that I'm going to choose is Andrew. Because I think that's a pretty damn cool name for a wolf. Andrew the Wolf. Oh, there's another wolf here. What the heck? There was just like one just here. That is actually very convenient. That's awesome. Okay, he can get in here. You can live inside of this room. There you go. <laughs> you must have known that this is where the wolves live. That's so funny. Okay, so you, my friend, you can be buddy. And uh oh, sit back down. And you can be Andrew. And it looks like we're going to have to go back home to name the final wolf that just suddenly appeared in the animal shelter. That was so strange. It's like he knew to go there. So let's go and give him a name, bless him. I'm going to name this wolf Tiki. I thought it was a really sweet name. So there we go. Tiki, let's go take him, his name or her. I'm not quite sure what she is yet. He is, he, she, she, he, we. Let's go on. Oh my gosh, there is another. What is even happening? Do you want to be tamed? Do you want to be tamed? Where are you going? Hey, where are you going? <laughs> I don't know if he wants to be tamed. Hey, get down from there. He's like, I ain't listening to you, woman. Oh my gosh. What is he doing? Where are you going? Do you not want to be tamed? <laughs> what even is happening? There is a wolf on the roof, but he doesn't want to get down. I tamed him! Woo! Right, okay, so we need to go and choose another name. Jeez, when I get back, there's probably gonna be one more. Okay, so I'm gonna call the new wolf Charlie. I saw that somebody requested that name in the comment section and I thought it would suit this wolf perfectly. So let's go do the final thing, which is to go and get the signs. And we can put their names on each of their stalls so that when people come and visit them, They'll know what their names are because of course we know what their names are but other people won't be able to see their names. So let's start off with Tiki. Tiki, female, two years old. Buddy, male, 19 months old. In here we have Andrew, male, four years old and in this one finally last but not least we have Charlie so let's put the extra bit of fence on here Charlie male eight years old so there we go we have got some animals in our animal shelter now it's starting to finally come alive if you want to leave some animal name suggestions down below because i need to tame some more wolves to fill up the rest of the stalls also make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and i'll catch you guys in the next one bye